You're watching Heroes Special. Heroes, a celebration of success. Life is in phases. Men are in sizes. The man Patrick Ifani Chuku Uba is a man of timber and caliber, as described by the late K.O. Mbadiwe of blessed memory. His enormous size in successes, adequate achievements and accomplishments simply distinguishes him as a force to be reckoned with in his time and also in this generation. Dr. Patrick Ifani Chuku Uba was born into a modest family of late Mr. and Mrs. Alphonsus Uba of Umu Anoka Otolo Neri, Neri North Local Government Area on the 3rd of September 1971. A man of humble beginning, amiable, likable, a good-natured personality. Dr. Patrick Ifani Uba is married to Mrs. Uchenna Uba. The union is blessed with five beautiful, wonderful children. The visionary chief executive officer promoter and managing director of Capital Oil and Gas Industries Limited. It's no doubt an ambitious business mogul who, from the day he ventured into oil and gas industry, decided to creatively distinguish himself and the company. Through dint of hard work, personal conviction to succeed, visionary leadership and doggedness, Dr. Ifan Yuba, in six years, between 2003 and 2009, took Capital Oil and Gas Industries Limited to a vantage position of becoming a dominant leader in the downstream sector of the oil and gas industries in Nigeria. Capital Oil and Gas, strategic importance to the Nigerian downstream oil and gas sector, was propelled by her massive investment in the sector, which include, but not limited to, a jetty capable of berthing four shuttle vessels simultaneously. Thank Farm with a storage capacity of over 190 million liters. 32-arm loading country capable of discharging up to 5 million liters of petroleum products, which exceeds the nation's daily consumption need. Fleets of over 400 trucks of distribution of petroleum products nationwide. Capital Oil and Gas has been responsible for the distribution of 40% of petroleum products in Nigeria. And at such times, when the nation had been held to ransom, Dr. Ifani Uba led his company to intervene on the part of the Nigerian people, an action that has endeared him to many. As the promoter and chief executive of Capital Oil and Gas Industries Limited, he also sits as the chairman on the board of several other companies, among which are Chevron Oronite and Chemical Company Limited. Authority Media and Publications Limited, Publishers of Authority Newspapers, Authority Radio and Television Limited, Owners of Authority 91.9 FM, FC Ifani Uba, First Nigerian Independent Oil Company Limited, Commodity Giants Nigeria Limited, Capital Group Congo in the Congo DR, Oil Force Nigeria Limited. Having built an oil and gas group that has successfully taken its undisputed place as a leader in the downstream sector of the Nigerian petroleum industry, Dr. Ifani Uba decided to venture into other sectors with the primary aim of replicating what he had done in the oil and gas sector. This hunger gave birth to football club Ifani Uba, one of the few privately run clubs in the Nigerian Professional Football League. The Authority Media and Publications, publishers of Authority Newspapers and Authority Radio with frequency 91.9 FM, currently transmitting in Anambra, Imo, Abia, Enugu, Delta, Edo, Kogi, Benue and Ondo State. In so little a time, FC Ifani Uba, the Authority Newspapers and Authority Radio have carved out niches for themselves as they gallantly strive towards leadership of their respective industries. The Authority Newspapers, which published its first edition on the 1st of October 2015, is the second Nigerian newspaper to go daily on its first day after Concord in 1982. A rare feat. In spite of the brevity of its existence, it has left an indelible mark on the information landscape of Nigeria and the world through its very powerful online presence. In keeping with his tradition of scoring first in January 2016, FC Ifani Uba became the first club in the Nigerian Professional Football League to attract and sign Brazilian footballers and trainers, which undoubtedly added value, flair, and glamour to the NPFL. Another first was achieved in August 2016 when FC Ifani Uba became the first Nigerian club to partner a European club as it signed a partnership deal with West Ham United of England, a team that has one of the best academics that produce the likes of Frank Lampard, Rio Ferdinand, Michael Carrick, Joe Cole, to mention a few. Dr. Ifani Uba's Midas touch is encapsulated in the fact that FC Ifani Uba, in just its second year of existence, won the NFF Federation Cup 2016 and Charity Cup 2016. By reason of Dr. Ifani Uba's think home mentality, burning desire to create jobs, empower the youth, and bring the needed development to his state of origin, Anambra State, he embarked on construction of a multi billion naira games and industrial village cramped with facilities such as two football stadia with multiple training pitches, industrial park, hospital, 
Sports Academy, Five Star Hotel, Technology Hub, Conference Center, Women and Youth Development Center, Indoor Sports Hall, Shopping Malls, Residential Estate, Corporate Office Complex, Linguistic Schools, Police Posts, Fire Service Stations, amongst other facilities and basic amenities. Not resting on his oars, Dr. Ifani Uba set up Authority 91.9 FM, situated in Newi, Anambra State. As it's the norm with whatever Dr. Ifani Uba establishes, Authority 91.9 FM has, in its short space of time, become the darling of the local communities in Anambra, Imo, Abia, Enugu, Delta, Edo, Kogi, Benue, and Ondo states. In May 2016, Dr. Ifan Yuba was unanimously elected the German Anambra State Football Association, ANSFA. Since his election, Dr. Uba has introduced a series of football programs aimed at promoting and developing football in the state. One of such programs is his novel initiative, Football Made in Anambra, One Family, One Footballer Project, which was endorsed by World's Football Governing Body, Federation International, the Football Association, FIFA. Dr. Uba, in a bid to touch as much lives as he could possibly reach, also committed his foundation to the donation of one million footballs to African children, an extension of the One Family, One Footballer project, all in a concerted attempt to foster football development at the grassroots. This initiative has also been endorsed by FIFA under the leadership of Gianni Infantino and Confederation of African Football, CAF, under the leadership of Ahmad Ahmad. Dr. Obai is a patron of the Nigerian Nationwide League 1, NNL, as well as a patron of Sports Writers Association of Nigeria, SWAN. He was also recently appointed by CAF as a member of the African Cup of Nations AFCON 2019 Organizing Committee. Dr. Ifan Yuba, in a bid to better the lives of his people, contested in 2014 Anambra gubernatorial elections under the Labour Party. In a keenly contested battle, despite being a first-timer to such a contest, Dr. Ifan Yuba made his presence known and left a mark in the contest. Since then, Dr. Ifan Yuba has been a household name in Anambra and Nigerian politics, which was expressly exhibited during the 2015 presidential and gubernatorial elections. Dr. Ifan Yuba's efforts were crowned in 2019 when he was elected as a senator representing Anambra South Senatorial District under the Young Progressive Party, YPP. Dr. Ifan Yuba was profiled by the Oxford Brooks magazine as one of the 40 on the 40 2009, that is, the top 40 young Nigerian business leaders under the age of 40. Dr. Patrick Ifanyu Uba has received numerous awards and honors both in Nigeria and abroad in recognition of his leadership qualities and outstanding performance in the oil and gas industry. By virtue of his creative leadership skills, ability, capacity, and in recognition of the giant strides he has made in business, coupled with his immense contributions to the Nigerian economy, he was conferred with an honorary doctor by the Federal University of Technology, Oweri. Dr. Ifani Uba is also a fellow with the Institute of Chartered Mediators and Counselors, ICMC. He has been actively involved in top flight business management for over two decades, with vast experience in international business, and has attended several local and international courses, seminars in leadership, and business management. Currently, he is undergoing an ownership stroke president management program at Harvard Business School, USA, while studying law at Bayes University, Abuja. In terms of service to God, Dr. Ufani Uba is currently constructing Our Lady of Assumption Catholic Cathedral, which consists of 109 parishes. He is the first individual in Nigeria to single-handedly fund a cathedral project of such magnitude. He has also been very instrumental in the renovation and refurbishment of his native church, St. Peter's Catholic Church, Newi, as well as the Anglican Bishop Court in Oka, where he invested tens of millions of naira, which helped the church reclaim the Bishop's Court land in Oka. In addition to all this, there is a part of this able visionary leader that cannot be left out. Dr. Ivani Patrick Uba, being an AKS member of Rotary Club, District 9140 is an avid philanthropist and a motivator by excellence. In acknowledgement of this need to serve humanity, provide succor to the needy and give back to society. Dr. Ifan Yuba, under the ages of Ifan Yuba Foundation, has established an educational fund that gives students free university education, the first of its kind in the Southeast, particularly Newi. Dr. Uba has also sunk boreholes, installed electricity transformers, and engages in constant repair and grading of roads. 
adding immense value to his community in the process. The philanthropist by excellence is fondly called Ewebe Chukuzo, meaning placing God first in all his dealings. His business interests include oil and gas, jetty development, bonded terminal, truck park facilities, media, sports development, construction, telecommunications, real estate, general merchandise and politics. Due to the enormous achievements of Senator Dr. Ifani Uba, a slogan was created for him, Gosim Kamfunanya. To mention a few, Ifani Uba Foundation has changed thousands of lives worldwide. Celebrating 365 days in office. Recently, I worked with the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and APs to facilitate the evacuation of 270 Nigerians from China, which were mostly my people. I negotiated non-payment accommodation fees for them during quarantine upon arrival. With all of these achievements, there's no gain saying the fact that Senator Dr. Patrick Ifanyu Uba still has so much to offer to Ndianambara. Gosim Kamfunanya, seeing is believing. Anambra, behold, one of the best and finest young men to come out of Igbo land. For me and my crew, my name is Ifama Chuku. Thank you for watching and also for listening. Heroes Special. Heroes, a celebration of success.